So that's really all I have to say about the game uh, as, as far as I'm concerned. Um, explain the positives and the negatives to the best of my abilities. Um, and again, I, I don't really blame Robert Sala for that late hit. I just, I, I just personally believe that, you know, he's telling his players, you know, if you, if you want to be a starter, if you want to be on the roster, you got to make a play. And that's what he tried to do, but it backfired. And luckily Jalen Hurts was, he was okay. It's no harm, no foul. Nick Sirianni yelling from the sidelines that people have been memeing that to death. My personal opinion, again, wasn't Robert Sala's fault, but it kind of is a breath of fresh air to have a coach that is that emotional on the sideline where like when we had Andy Reid and we had Chip Kelly and Doug Peterson, it was like those dudes were like sedated on the sideline. Like if there was a bad call, they would never be in the ref's face. Almost never. Really, for Andy Reid, it was like later in his time in Philadelphia. Otherwise, he was just completely stoic. Like, have some emotion on the sidelines. Sometimes you don't like to see that because other fans are like, oh, stop crying. But, like, you could tell that those dudes are really in for the team. And, obviously, I hope that Nick Sirianni makes a jump uh, as as time goes on uh, to being a better head coach. Because, again, he's our head coach. I want him to do well.